let me give you a test. Tell me, in your own words, why man was created and what is the end of man? Man was created to worship God for the future of man depends on if he becomes a child of God or refuses to let God rule over him. Amazing! Tell me, what university did you study at? I didn't know they left us in universities, but the time has changed. I'm not in a university, Professor Sherlock. I just go to Sunday school at my church. Oh, my, my, my. You're saying you learned all these truths from Sunday school? Well, it's pretty much in the Bible. You just have to find them and believe them. I told you he wasn't, she was impressive. <laughs> yes, yes. But I have another question first before we move on. I've been reading about the return of Jesus in the book of Revelation. Have you heard about the return of Jesus, Kylie? Yes, sir. It's amazing. When Jesus returns to earth, he will be to judge all, for all evil, for he will come back not as the Lamb of God who took away sin, but as the, but as the Lion of the tribe of Judah. To restore justice, make everything right, and wipe away every tear caused by pain and suffering. Yes, I read the same thing, but tell me, how can we know everything in the Bible is true? Well, my Sunday school teacher told me that the truths of God's word have to be received by faith. The same way we believe Jesus to be the Lord, we can accept all truths in the Bible. Faith is simply trusting in Jesus. When we trust him, we are living the truth and realness of God's word. If Jesus can live in our hearts by faith, we can accomplish everything he promises in the Bible by faith. Doesn't that just make sense? I believe it does. I believe it does. Perhaps we could use your insights to teach us a few things. Imagine that. Children teaching adults how to live by faith. Amazing! Well, as I understand it, the Holy Spirit is the true teacher. We just have to be teachable, so that even we can be taught by a child. Does that mean I can have one of those magnifying glasses and play with your computers? I can show you some cool games. Of course! <laughs> as soon as Watson here learns how to trace his ancestry back to Noah. That could take forever! Precisely, Kelly. Precisely. With this additional insight, I believe we can conclude that God has had an amazing plan. From the, f from the creation of man in the garden, to the fall of Adam, to Noah's flood, to the top of Babel, to Jesus Christ on the cross, but not being bound by 